Hey guys, welcome back. So today's video is going to be a fall haul. This is gonna be a one store only. Today's store is going to be H&M. I'm gonna to try to do more just one store hauls because last time I did one with Target, you guys seem to really like that just because you don't have to wonder where anything is from. And anytime I buy like a lot from one store, I feel like it's just easier to do it that way. So anyways, today's gonna to be H&M, not sponsored, anything like that. I wish H&M, give me a ring if you're interested. But yeah, I'm gonna be showing you guys a bunch of pieces that I picked up from there for the fall And there's some stuff that I bought online some stuff that I bought in store So if you guys want to see what I picked up then let's get started And I'm gonna have to scroll you guys down because my nose literally will not stop running And I don't know if I can really have my face in the frame because I'm a little bit sick right now So we're gonna just take it down a notch okay <laughs> all right so obviously here's the first top that i'm starting off wearing and i love this i love a pop of leopard as you can see i'm a leopard girl especially in the fall like i'm all about leopard as a neutral so this is just a fun little top just a lightweight long sleeve button down v-neck and then it just has this fun little tie in the front you don't want to have it untied though because then you just have these weird things flapping around and you don't want that so i thought this was really cute nice casual and then i have it just paired with these jeans that are also from h&m so these are just a nice you know really dark gray like faded black wash denim with some distressing in the knees they are very stretchy actually and um it is a button fly waist which i'm not really a fan of but these are actually really comfortable has some stretch to it they are high waisted this is what they look like from the back so if you see these throughout the haul these are the pair that i'm wearing so i just wanted to show you guys those really quick and they also hit me at a pretty good length i don't know if you guys can really see but they hit me like right at the top of my foot so i could you know cuff them like up one if i wanted to um but they're actually not a bad length for me at all and i am five foot three so next up is this cami i have this in black from last year and i'm always trying to get more colors but they do sell really quickly so it's just this lace cami with this kind of like satiny material and i just love these for layering underneath cardigans blazers you know a leather jacket they're just really just basic pieces that i feel like everyone needs in their wardrobe and i just really love the lace detailing of this one this is like a light taupe shade and like I said I already have it in black I just really liked this color in particular for fall because it's very neutral I have never seen this color in store I've only seen the black and white in store and then the rest I think might only be online or just you know bigger stores but I just thought I would show you guys this and this you definitely have to tuck in because it is very long and I don't know who's really wearing it like this unless you're wearing it as a nightgown I don't know so then next is this sweater i love this sweater it's like a really wide v-neck with this really pretty lace trim i love lace details i feel like it's just really feminine and pretty so this has a lace detail it goes all the way around the whole entire neckline so it's just really cute you can just pull it more off the shoulder if you want to or you know wear it more traditionally as just like a plain old v-neck but i kind of like it a little bit slouchy and off the shoulder so that's what this one looks like i also got this in black which i'm not going to try on because it's just the same thing but i'll just show you guys it also comes in black and you know the same thing so yeah that's what this looks like and the material is soft it's not scratchy or anything like that i know some h&m sweaters can be a little bit scratchy but this is not one of them Next, I picked up this boyfriend cardigan is what they're calling it. So it is a cardigan and it's supposed to look like it's your boyfriend's, obviously. I got extra small, which is my normal size. So I didn't want it super oversized. Obviously, if you want it really oversized, you know, size up. But I thought it was going to look a little bit too much on me. So I just got my regular size and I do like it. So it's just like a v-neck. Obviously, you can wear it open, but I kind of liked it just... You know buttoned up so it's very comfy stretchy i like that it goes like over past my thumbs i don't know i feel like that adds like to the boyfriend effect and it does come in a bunch of colors i just decided to get the black i may go back and get other colors i also like that it's kind of like a cropped length i mean it's not like a crop top but it's not like a boyfriend sweater that's huge and long and baggy so i appreciate the length of it obviously you can stretch it down but i just like it kind of 
gathered like that. All right, so then we have another black sweater. I will say this one is a little bit scratchy. I'm hoping like once I wash it, it'll get a little bit less scratchy. It's not like unbearable, but the material is not as soft as the other ones that I showed. But I really liked the silhouette of this one. Obviously, it's more of like a oversized look, but I liked the neckline. I liked that the sleeves are a little bit bigger. And yeah, you can just tuck this into the front and you know give some more shape that way but i just love a basic black sweater i just feel like i should just be drinking a nice cup of yummy coffee with this sweater this is an extra size so this is not oversized at all obviously if you want a bigger size up but this is my normal size and i do really like the shape of it so i wanted to show you guys this cute little hat that i got i'm not like 100 percent sold on it but i thought it was cute um so it is this i don't even know what these are called what are these called okay now that i'm trying it on i feel like a douchebag um so i don't know I thought it was gonna be cuter. Maybe it's the angle. See, the problem is, is that the small size, my head is too big for the small, but then I feel like my head is too small for the medium large. I don't know, it was cuter in my head, but I thought this would be really cute with the sweater, but now I just feel like a freaking fool because this looks so big. What? It, why does it look so big? I'm gonna have to get it custom made. And I don't think I'm going to do that. Next, we have this sweater, which is definitely big, oversized. It's so incredibly soft. The color is, you know, kind of like a caramely oatmeal color. It's really cute. And I just love the texture of this. This is actually small instead of an extra small. And I would have got an extra small, but they didn't have one. So I just got this anyway. And I do really like it. And uh, probably it'll shrink when I wash it because I'm not very good at doing laundry. I don't really try to be good at it, but <laughs> this will probably shrink, so I'm not going to be too upset. But I just really liked it. I feel like, again, I should be drinking a cup of coffee, and it's just so soft, and you could just really just cover your whole body with this. If you want to be a spy, you could do it. So it's just really cute and, um, you know, cozy, so... And it is kind of longer in the back, so if you wanted to wear it with, like, a legging of some sort, I think that you could because it is a little bit longer on me anyway. I don't have a very long body, though. Okay, so this is a similar silhouette to the black one that I showed, but this one is a different material. This is, like, a true, like, knit sweater, as the other one is more of, like, a fuzzy knit sweater. This one is just, like sweater sweater this one is also a heavier material like it just feels heavier on your body but it is um a lot softer and i like that it has like these little i don't know perforated holes i don't know what those are called but again just really like this silhouette it's just comfy oversized but without being too chunky or big and i really liked the cream color of this also and again you could wear this with leggings because it is a little bit longer in the back and in the front obviously if you untuck it then we have this black floral top it's kind of like i don't know a little bit of a peplum because it's gathered here it also has these like cute little frillies at the wrist it's like gathered at the wrist and then has like a little baby bell sleeve and i just think it's really cute i love a fall floral so i really liked the pattern of this it's black with the blush and yellow i thought was really cute so then we have this top it's like a blush eyelet chiffon kind of material has these little bell sleeves around the wrist which i thought was really cute i don't know if it looks that good on um i like the frills and everything i feel like it's just like very romantic looking i'm not really sure if it's that flattering on me i'm not sure if i'm going to keep it but i think it is really cute i just don't know if i like it on me or not i feel like maybe it's just not fitting me correctly but i do think that it's really cute just maybe not on me i don't know what do you guys think i just thought it was cute obviously it would need to be steamed as well but um i don't know if i like it do you guys like it let me know what you think then i wanted to show you guys two blazers so the first one is this one it is just basic black 
there's some dog hair on there but you know it happens um i just feel like the look of this blazer you know with jeans with like a stiletto really cute pump maybe like a leopard one or a colored one some kind of print but i just really liked this one so it is a blazer but it, i feel like it doesn't look too boxy like the cut of it um is really flattering i feel like it just makes you look like a boss ass bitch i don't know um i feel like a lot of blazers make me look just too like worky and i don't know obviously you could wear this to work but i feel like this you could definitely just wear with jeans um just regular blue jeans or obviously these uh dark wash that i have on today but i feel like it's just really flattering and i'm into it i like that the sleeves are already like shortened and gathered so it looks like you kind of like roll them up but they actually just already are like that so i think that's really cute and it doesn't look like too bulky so this one's a gray and white plaid print um i like the plaid this one is a little bit less structured so as you can see it doesn't really give me the same shape as the other one this one's a little bit more casual too even though it is plaid i feel like the material is just like a little bit more on the casual side but i do still really like the plaid you know menswear inspired look for fall so yeah i feel like i should just be asking for some sort of businesswoman special. Then I just have this basic plaid button down. I liked the color of it. The, you know, olive green with the black plaid stripe. I thought it was really cute. Um, kind of like a more subtle plaid. Like some plaids, I feel like the contrast is so high or just like there's too many colors going on that it's not flattering or you feel like too country bumpkin, which sometimes I feel like that because I'm from like a farm town and when I wear too much plaid and if I wear like a flannel sometimes I feel like just a little bit too much so that's what so this is what this looks like I think it's really cute obviously I have it tied in the front but you could tuck it in as well if you would rather tuck it in but I thought it was really cute and obviously on trend for fall with the plaid then lastly, I wanted to show you guys some plaid bottoms. So this is a really cute skirt. Just, you know, a, kind of like a stretchy material. The plaid is black, white, and a little bit of maroon or like brownish tone. And so this is really cute with just a sweater or, you know, a button-down top would be really cute with this also. The skirt is like high-waisted and elastic, so it's pretty forgiving. I got the extra small. I don't have like any hips, so... If you have hips, maybe size up. It's really cute, very soft. Definitely would be cute with booties. You could throw tights on with this. All right, so that is going to wrap up my fall haul with H&M. That's everything that I picked up from there recently. There will be more fall store hauls coming soon. I'm just waiting for things to come in the mail because I don't have a lot of cool stores where I live. Um, but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what your favorite piece was and what other stores you guys want to see next. And I will see you guys in my next video.